Japan bracing for Typhoon Shanshan, a rare powerful storm slowly approaching from the southwest. The threat of heavy rains, strong winds and storm surges has residents and businesses hunkering down. Evacuation orders have been issued for tens of thousands and public transportation suspended in some areas even before landfall. And emergency warning in place for a storm with an intensity that occurs only once every few decades. Japan's meteorological agency says Shanshan is approaching with maximum winds of up to 180 kilometers per hour. This is only the fourth time the agency has issued such a warning. In Mishima village in Kagoshima prefecture, the emergency warning is at the rarely used highest level 5. This means conditions could turn life-threatening and residents need to take action to protect themselves immediately. Around 800,000 are covered by evacuation orders issued for Kagoshima as well as Aichi and Shizuoka prefectures. Shanshan is expected to make landfall in Kyushu, the country's southwesternmost main island and home to more than 12.5 million people on Thursday. The government has been focusing on evacuating people to safer ground, cancelling earthquake drills scheduled over the weekend to free up disaster response teams. Dozens of domestic flights and train services to and from southwestern cities and islands have been cancelled at least until Friday. Local forecasters expect up to 600 millimetres of rain in southern Kyushu over a 24-hour period. Winds are expected to be strong enough to cause homes to collapse. By the weekend, Shanshan is expected to strike the central and eastern regions, including the capital, Tokyo. But the storm's effects are already being felt in parts of Japan even before landfall. In Aichi, a landslide buried at least one house. Heavy rains over Gamagori City had brought down a wall of mud, rocks and other debris that swept away the residents of a family of five. Aichi is also home to Toyota headquarters, which has suspended work in all 14 plants in the country in anticipation of the storm.